all defenses are or representing a country, or is it water jump, or the triples and the double and the sponsor friends? That means we have eight uh, signature country fences. Number one is representing France, is there at the end with the, with the green pillars. It's an auction, uh, 145 in front, 147 on the back, 120 spread, it's not big, but always I build in the first number, defense number one as an easy fence. Number two, representing the United States, is the Roche, Rochemore Wall. That wall was in, in, in the Olympic Games of Atlanta, and this wall has 155. After I have seven stride, uh, six stride forward, or seven very steady, to an oxer, one is, is big, but not too much wide. It's 153 high, but, but one, only 140 spread. Is representing Swiss. After we go into the British flag, there will be a, a, it's a vertical alone, will be 157 high. Turning to the water jump, the water jump will be 4 meter 20 and go straight to the German fence number six. It's a skinny fence representing the German flag, black red and yellow and and have 160 high. Come back to a double combination here where are the great pillars. A is the oxer there, two stride, then 80 to this to the B. The, the B I will move the other pillars to make the B for the pre nation. After we go to the sponsor fence, what is some core now that will be Bank of Montreal. Okay, from, the, from there, from the combination to that, we have eight stripes to that also. After is far along the Canada plank. And after roll back to the Belgian triple bar, what is at the end. And I have 27, 80, what is steady, eight, seven stripes or six very forward to one stride a little bit long is 780 to an oxen and after seven uh, my mind I getting old 760 <laughs> to another vertical turning is a free approach yeah. to the last fence is big is 153 by 180 I will look in the condition of the footing to, to, to adjust depending on maybe I go in less spread or I adjust something like that what I have now when the class starts. But here we don't know, can be sunny in five minutes and, and can be the best day of the year or can be worse, I don't know. We have a contention course for the second round. And we don't jump the water jump maybe. Depends on the conditions. The judges and myself will take the decision to 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 if we going to take it out the water for the second round or not. Depends of the condition. If we take it out, I will use the Rolex fence what is there to the same uh, German skinning. And the course will be two second shorter. It's about 15 meters short. You're expecting how many clears? Sure. With these conditions, uh, it's, uh, yeah, it's, it's difficult to predict with a good condition. With these conditions, you ask asking to me a very difficult question. But, but I hope we have one or two double clears and winning team with four or eight faults. I hope or 12 max. Mm -hmm. But double clings, one or two, like normal, I, I have, but sometimes when you have these conditions for you, you going down and down too much, or it's, it's difficult. You know, it's more easy to have prediction when you have perfect conditions. I know you want to know, but you have a bet here. I don't, I don't know. <laughs>